Here on the Patuxent River in Maryland, a tributary of the Chesapeake Bay, this one-of-a-kind raft was designed and built by Ryan Abrahamson, founder of Terrain360, a virtual mapping company. Inspired by Google Street View, Abrahamson has created 360-degree virtual mapping tours of rivers with a view of being in a canoe. Producing a virtual river map is a challenge. On the, the center column we have at the top, we have the six cameras. The very top we have a light sensor and a GPS unit. And down here at the bottom we have a PC with an ultra bright screen, uh, touch screen. The cameras are triggered by the computer. We record at the same time GPS coordinates. We record barometric pressure, humidity, temperature. As the raft motors along the Patuxent, the extreme wide angle lens cameras shoot photos simultaneously every 12 meters. It takes hundreds of thousands of the high resolution images to create the virtual panoramic waterway tour. Today, Abrahamson is adding to the Patuxent River map with the addition of 20,000 new photos taken from a cove, with all kinds of things getting captured along the way. The virtual tours of 11 of the Chesapeake Bay Rivers is funded by the Chesapeake Conservancy, an environmental group, and can be viewed on their website, chesapeakeconservancy.org. What we wanted to do was to give people the information and inspiration they needed to get outside, get on our rivers, explore the Chesapeake Bay so that they'll protect the Chesapeake Bay. Abrahamson says while the virtual tours show the beauty of the rivers, they also reveal environmental problems. Shoreline erosion, we look for pollution, um, you know, storm drains, we see a lot of tires in the waterways, and just by showcasing that, it gives, you know, the general public like, oh, wow, there's, you know, Things need to be cleaned up. We want to care more about, you know, where we live and our environment and the waterways. Rivers like the Patuxent and others that flow into the Chesapeake Bay are near major cities such as Washington and Baltimore, giving more people the opportunity to enjoy the Chesapeake Bay watershed. People can use the virtual tours to plan their trips from their desk at home or at work, but they can also use them out on the water on their smartphone from wherever they are. Today the rivers are part of the Captain John Smith Chesapeake National Historic Trail, the first all-water historic trail in the United States. Deborah Block, VOA News, on the Patuxent River in Maryland.